Please to Capsule 12. Capsule 12, come in. You there, Stan? I'm sorry. Who is this? Ah, there he is. Why, if I'd known the big man himself was running my orientation, I'd have put a tie on. Ah, there's gratitude for you. The finest in Unitrench deep sea fashion, and he talks about dressing up. How you doing, old man? <sighs> old indeed, but fine. Glad to have you back. Yeah, well, you're probably the only one. Let's just get this suit calibrated, okay? Drowning on my first day would be embarrassing. I mean, headlines alone. Oxygen and seals were signed off by the prep team. Well, great. My compliments to the tailor. Not just any suit, Dad. Back to the gills with cutting-edge technology. Uh-huh. Just means there's more that can go wrong. Forget about it, you'll be fine. All right, last thing, helmet mic check. Check, check. This thing on. That'll do it. So how about it, lad? Ready to head back into the blue. <sighs> you have no idea. Okay. All right. Just like in training. Nice and easy. That's the spirit. Don't forget, keep an eye on your oxygen. Try not to overextend the seals. All set up by now. Should be a big door right in front of you. Head through there. That's the garage bunker. something like this to get all my stuff down. Better not have broken anything. Hmm. It's darker in here than it is out there. Well, that's not right. Looks like something tripped up the fuses. Been a while since anyone's been down there. Hang on a moment, I've got maintenance on the other line. There, lad. You're going to need to power up the place manually, so head on through to the generator room. Fairly sure I didn't tick engineer on my application form. Lucky for you, Unitrench had the lowest common denominator in mind when designing our facilities. There's a couple of jennies in here with big old startup levers. Find, all voila, instant power. Whatever. But if this goes wrong, I'm not paying for it. Done. 
we have power. How big is this place? Big? It's the hub for a load of the systems in these parts. The garage itself is another part of the facility. See that door beneath the fans? I'm gonna have to swim to it. You're going to have to swim to it. Uh, okay. All right. We're doing this. Remember, you can adjust your depth as well as your direction. That suit's pretty hardy, so don't worry about poking any holes in it. Believe me, the Pentelnecks put it through more stress than you ever will. Okay, um, another door. Hang on there a moment. Time for what the boys in HR call a learning opportunity. If you're sure, why walk when you can swim? Have a look over there. Oh, uh, yeah. Oxygen stick. Two steps ahead, as usual. I forgot they integrated them into the training. Pretty impressive stuff, Tim. In-suit oxygen resupply. You have no idea how much of a headache. Don't go leaving that empty case just lying around, though. Unit trench are committed to a minimum impact operation. Also, you never know, might come in handy. these flippers. Tom's a good one. Head on through to the garage. Getting a little claustrophobic in here. Wait. Are you telling me they haven't put the wallpaper up? Oh, Stan, it's lovely. Clouds and little birds. Soothing. <laughs> Very funny. And there she is, the moon. Pride of the Unitrench fleet. Really? No, she's a piece of junk. But good enough for the likes of you. Really helps the crushing anxiety, old man. I'm joking. He's a solid piece of kid. Now you're a fully qualified Unitrench service diver, we spared no expense. Well, we thought she might come in handy. We'll have to decouple those clamps first, obviously. A couple of buttons on each side there. You know the drill.
Green across the board. Looks like we're good. We're all right. Door should have unlocked. Off you go. Doors working as intended, I see. The wonders of automation. Okay. I was kind of expecting a big reveal there, Tim. It's all about timing, dear boy. You'll see. Lots of life. Even down here. Now, let's get you out of this cave and we'll see about getting you to your new home. There she is. Told you it was about the timing. She can be a beauty, that's for sure. All right, quite enough of that. Off you go. You need to reach the life module. That's the tub you'll be calling home for the next few weeks. You can use the sonar system to highlight your position. Should make getting lost a little harder. I see it. Heading there now. So just, uh, take it slow. Pay no mind to the drone there. It's assigned to the area. Our jobs and so on. But, uh, try not to run into it. In the airlock. Excellent. Get that suit off and call me on the radio when you're inside. Just gonna sit for a second. It's uh this is all. Hey, take your time. Been a big day. Yeah. Thanks, Tim. No worries. See you inside. Okay, this is not as bad as I expected. It's actually... Okay, cozy. Um, is this right? Hey, Tim. Finally. 
Okay, now the fun part. Press that button over there on the panel. Is that the light switch? You'll see. Let's start with the storage room. Make sure your stuff arrived in one piece. Well, this is downright hospitable. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, this'll do nicely. This looks like the storage room. All right. Emma would love some shots of the wildlife down here. Think everything made it down okay? Thank God. If something had happened to these. Well, should hang them up at some point. Without drilling any holes. the rest of the day's your own. Make yourself at home, get some rest. Tomorrow we get to work. Nighty night. Not Tim. Hmm. Not bad, considering what I went through. I should probably check in. Good to go. Hi, this is Emma. I'm not here at the moment, obviously, so do the thing after the thing. <sighs> Lost. Hi, Emma. It's Stan. I mean, it's it, it's me. Hi. I uh, I made it down okay. Uh, I know I didn't. Uh, what we said before I left. You you said you needed space, right? And I needed space, so so yeah, this is space. <laughs> Uh, just... The, Tim set me up with a phone. Obviously, I, it's the number I gave you. He said the, the line should be fixed by now, but... Yeah, it's... You know, Trent, so... Who knows? I miss us. I miss... Uh, you know what? I'm gonna let you go. Call me. You should, you should get to bed. Who is this for? I'm the only one down here and they already bagged me. Guess I'm responsible for you guys now. Day tomorrow? Let's get some shut eye. What's that? 
Not here. Stay down here in bad dreams already. This will come in handy. Should anything untoward happen? Good morning, Stanley. It is 7.32 a.m. on Tuesday, the 27th of March. I hope you have a productive day. Is there any coffee on this wreck? Checking. Yes, 10 kilograms of happy morning instant coffee remaining. Great. Giant oil conglomerate thing doesn't work out. Unitrench has a bright future in mattresses. Only the best for our chosen few. Now, ready to stop the day? Raring. Right then. Head on over to the job board to your right there. We'll post up the daily tasks each morning. Simple as that. Simple as that. See you out there. Uh, is this thing on? I'll have to contact these guys when I go back up. Consider joining. Alright. You seem... Easy enough. Relatively speaking.
lights are all green, ready to go. I thought it preferred warmer waters. Well, I uh, wouldn't know anything about that. Hmm. Hey there. Oh. <laughs> oh, wow. Hey there. Let me guess. Joe? Yeah. Hey. Hey there, you. He's quite the celebrity around these parts. Reckon he lost the rest of his pod a while back, poor bugger. Don't worry, he doesn't bite. Ah, uh, this job... definitely has its perks. Mission accomplished. Roger that. A job well done. Now you want to... Hell, to the sea. Tim? Roger. I know this is none of my beeswax, but, um, did you get a hold of Emma? No. Gave it a go, but she was... out. Ah. Yeah. There is definitely a leak here, Tim. Go. Something pouring out of a pipe. Yep, confirmed on our end. Run off from the refinery. Horrible stuff. Okay. Not to worry. Follow the pipe there until you reach the flow control. That should stop it. Roger. The company has been pushing the system pretty hard of late. There's been more demand. Manufacturing, consumer demand, wars, that sort of thing. Means there might be more leaks. Small ones, you know. Popping up every now and again. An eye out. A component of some kind.
Can't you run off now? Fuel for the fire. Stop leaking. Excellent. The local fishies will, I'm sure, be grateful. Head on back to the life module for now. Don't want you overdoing it on. Now what? Timmy, you... Connection lost. Okay. Best head back. I think we're back. We're back. Sorry about that. Happens from time to time. Crafting table in the storage room that's just been activated. Yeah. Noticed it earlier. Nice bit of kit. Usually we'd have the startup blueprints ready to go, but we're running a bit behind. Get over and grab them, would you? Blueprint. Perfect. Uh, Tim will go believe. 
unrealistic if I don't focus on the objective. Okay, Stan. Back to work. Focus on your current objective. Crafting blueprint. Got them. Head inside and get crafting. What if I need more raw materials? Ah, well, times are tough, you know. Belt tightening all over the shop. You'll have to source them yourself. I should get back to the task at hand. I should get to the life module. Officially a master recycler. Good way to reuse all the junk. You may find out there. Now, we're trying to pin down where these comms glitches are coming from. We need you to check the local signals just outside. Follow your marker. I can do that. Stand out. 